actually got my uh, associate's degree at a community college in a two-year program very similar to this. Uh, I thought that I was going to be a technician. I ended up actually being a supply chain professional and I bought integrated circuits, semiconductor, microchips for our instrument clusters that we made for the automotive industry. I understood a lot more about semiconductor manufacturing practices through those and I, I did that for about 25 years. Uh, I always knew that I wanted to teach and so behind the scenes I was getting my bachelor's and my master's and trying to set myself up in case someday I could become a professor and luckily five years ago uh, that experience all paid off and I started working here at Columbus State. Our electromechanical engineering program not only prepares a tech by giving them a base foundation of knowledge in electronics but also in mechanical engineering practices. So you're going to have the base understanding of electricity and what, what's going on in a machine. When the machine, how do you turn it on? What's going on once it's turned on? You're also going to focus on the mechanics of a machine, studying different materials and the way that those materials are used in a certain process. What we're adding is a couple of courses that really teach you about foundational semiconductor manufacturing practices. So the college has worked with other two-year and four-year colleges along with Intel to come up with the best program that will suit the needs of Intel. Not to forget that this same program can prepare you for a lot of careers in Central Ohio. It creates a lot of opportunity and I've seen that over the last couple of years. We don't have students that look for jobs very long. There's just too many out there for them and great opportunities. At our program we can meet people where they're at. In our program, we have small class sizes, so we're able to work and have time with individuals one-on-one. -on -one. We're able to meet with them, improve them if they're struggling in certain areas. We're able to, to pick them up. So having a degree in electrical engineering technology can open up so many doors for you. So I don't think you're pigeonholed into any particular career. If you want to follow the normal path, absolutely, you can be a, a knowledgeable, technician at any of the companies you see around Columbus and make a great living. But that's not the only place you can go. If I look back to my own life prior to getting my degree, I didn't get my associate's degree until I was 26. And the reason why is I kept telling myself, wait until the time's right. Just wait until everything in your world's perfect and then you can go into college. And I would tell you that that's kind of backwards. I've seen a better job than I've ever seen in my life right here in Central Ohio. Our college is one of the most cost-effective colleges you're gonna find in the country. I would say don't wait until the time's perfect because then the right time might pass you by. This is the time to get your engineering technology degree.